Hey, sincerely wonderful. Good morning to everyone, and welcome to today's stream. My name is Digam Video, and I'm a video game streamer who primarily plays RPG games. I'm also a hobby voice actor and singer, so you might hear me do one or both of those things during today's stream. Well, I think this one is going to be a bit special and perhaps won't even require me to do either of those things because today we are introducing a new game to our lineup that you might be familiar with <laughs> Persona 3 Reload the remake of the third installation of um, the Persona main series and all of that entails Starting today, and uh, probably in the coming years, because that's how long it takes me to finish games like this. I'll be playing Persona 3 regularly on streams, as well as uh, well, when I get around to editing, post the VODs on YouTube. Without further ado, let's go ahead and pull up the game. For those who are just joining us and uh, have no idea what Persona is, um, you're going to figure it out as we go along. <laughs> but feel free to ask any questions. Though I warn you, uh, my filter is not very good. So there is a non-zero chance I'll just spoil the game for you if you plan on playing this for yourself. So if moving forward, you would like to experience Persona 3 story blind, and you've somehow kept yourself under a rock for the better part of uh, two decades. Um, you know, it is all right if you would like to seek avenues elsewhere or play the game for yourself first before uh, joining us for regular streams or watching any of these bots on YouTube. Still here? <laughs> or maybe you've come back after a year of playing the game for yourself. Either way, thanks for staying in. I'm much more comfortable with the controller, even though it's a turn-based RPG, um, which is what the Persona series is known for. I don't know, the, the comfort of using controller is just ingrained in me. Let's go. I was saying earlier that we keep on getting the rough, but even I have not yet seen all of them. Expensive, my guy. <laughs> okay, um, actually, I made a mistake here. So, sound settings. Go for mid. And 
voice quality. We seem perfectly good MP3 player, am I right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Um, Koala, since you're not streaming yet, is there anyone you want me to shout out um, in your stead? There we go. Credits. Oh, straight up, just credits. <laughs> but yeah, welcome in everyone. And, uh, get ready for the ride of your life. Okay. This is the thing I'm, I was wondering that uh, when I asked around in the forums and Discord server if difficulty will affect the drop rate of like uh, yen and items. And so far, no one seems to really know. So I'm torn between going for hard difficulty or uh, peaceful difficulty. If, if I can, if the reward rate is higher uh, for easier difficulties, like it was in Persona Five, I would switch to peaceful, like mid game, uh, just so that I won't have to grind for twenty hours versus two hours, because that's how the multiplier works or whatever. Uh, I guess L that be forty eight. If you want to shout an awesome human, okay, sure. Shout out to. El Pepe 48. However, if there's no difference in drop rates, I'll just stick to hard the entire um, entire playthrough. Needed Persona 5 on normal. Okay, respect, respect. Okay, uh, let's go. Now, if you go for merciless difficulty, uh, advanced difficulty but weaknesses and strengths are increased as well as instant death attacks are almost sure to kill you so you have to like have a lot of uh what you call this war dispelling dolls and i believe that in the original game that in merciless you couldn't carry over your data from a previous save so like you couldn't just you know power your way through it so i think we're gonna stick with hard uh for sure Significantly challenging combat. Your choice of difficulty will not affect the story and can be changed at any time, excluding Merciless. The other Star Martin difficulty? Hey, it's a visual novel game. That's totally fair. But yeah, for folks um, who are watching the stream currently, go check out El Tepe 48. Uh, El 48 seems to be a Pokemon streamer, up and coming and new. So your support would be very much appreciated to uh, help them get to, you know, affiliate status or just generally uh, motivate them to keep streaming and uh, you know, welcome them to the Twitch community. Indeed, we support all friends. Oh, yes, downloadable, bleh, downloadable content has been detected because I got the pre-order premium edition, which comes with the art book, the soundtrack, uh, additional Persona 4 music, Persona 4 Golden music, as well as every upcoming DLC for uh, for the foreseeable future. Um, I wasn't clear on whether it was just the initial DLC packs that, you know, come from the launch of the game, or if it's like all DLC in perpetuity, which I guess we'll find out uh, when Persona 3 comes out with the next DLC. The DLC costs can be obtained from the closet of your room. So we got the Persona 5 Royal Clothes, Persona 4 Golden Clothes, things like that. Oh, and DLC Personas, right. Love the PS5 Phantom Thieves costume. Right now, we are playing on PC um, instead of my Persona, uh, instead of my PlayStation 4, for the very reason that we got the premium edition of the game. Uh, there wasn't really the same option per se. Uh, for getting it on PlayStation versus getting it on Steam. Yeah, there's the golden and royal background music set. Ah, okay, I'll stick with the Persona 3 music. Time 
leads for no one. All are equal in its flow. All lives born to their ends. You, that glimmer of the finite future, you have a single year. Go forth and live in the time given to you. Even these halcyon days of repose, let your heart guide you and never stray from its path. Easy cop keys? Like, you already got the game, you're getting another one? I'm wondering about the cost of the premium uh, copy of this game. Uh, don't worry about it. <laughs> I had my family member help me out with paying for it, and uh, I definitely wouldn't have been able to afford it by myself. Let's just say that. Already, you can tell that the animation has like, been updated. And then pull the trigger. Oh, uh, trigger warning, everyone. Uh, if you didn't see at the beginning of the stream, um, detections of bullying, violence, and suicide. Uh, so, you know, if those things like are troubling for you, you might want to something else. Your discussion is advised. Please board before the scheduled departure time. I have to say, it is a bit jarring not seeing the completely like paint bucket black mouths from the old animation and the the rougher hairstyles of like um, less shading on it. <laughs> Just looking at Yukari's hairstyle earlier, you could see like the individual strands. Mountain Dew time. Mountain Dew. We have more caffeine than coffee. Not sponsored. Ah. So just gonna... Gonna walk on over that. That's probably fine. I arrived so late. Better hurry up. Even so die dorm. That's where I'll be staying from now on. Wait. That's where I'll be staying from now on. Mm. So, yeah. That's where I'll be staying from now on. Yeah, let's go with mid, mid pitch. That's where I'll be staying from now on. It should be just up ahead. I can't quite uh, replicate um, Yuri Leventhal's voice, so I'm not gonna force myself to. He has a unique pitch that you can't quite get and is difficult to maintain for a game that I'm going to be playing for over a year. And also, I'm not sure it quite matches the tone of um, the specific character. Looks it. Blah, blah. My tongue is still waking up. Looks like the entire station is under quite construction. I'm just gonna look for secrets. Looks like the power's out. Oh gosh. I can already tell this is gonna be a very time consuming game. <laughs> because part of me wants to like look at everything. And I'm probably gonna. This the coffin. I wonder what's in these things. These things are everywhere. Eh, they're just you know, uh, they're just stands promoting the game. What's this doing here? Never heard of the coffin party? Where have 
one go? Oh, sorry, that's corpse party. <laughs> oh, much. It looks like these stairs can stay on the floor. I can stay. I should really have to go. Okay, fine. Ooh. I just noticed that there's creatures in the protagonist's shirt. Oh, dang. That must take a lot of effort. Yeah. Walking speed actually matches the background. <laughs> huh? It's a normal run at midnight, am I right? Both going to convenience store for uh, late night hot dogs or donuts, know what I'm talking about. Even so, I dorm. I guess this is it. Sure is big tonight, huh? Welcome. It's you. That's rude. You're late. I've been waiting a long time. <laughs> if you wish to proceed, sign your name here. It's a contract. Oh, right. Um, I think there's supposed to be a last name as well as a first name. There's no need to be scared. All it says is that you accept full responsibility for your actions. Hmm. That, that's probably fine, right? I think that's the uh, nature of free will. Uh, the, I, uh, I delivereth all equally to the same end. I hereby agree to the statement above and choose the fate of my own will. I'm sorry, what? I, I can read that, even though it's kind of blurry. It's telling us that we're going to kill people? <laughs> I delivereth all equally to the same end. I hereby agree to save the above. Okay, this was not the same contract from before. We're definitely gonna go with Pika. I don't know if I wanna use Nvidia for the last name. Though. Okay, if Mitsuru and the other um, seniors are gonna call us by our last name, uh, uh, See, before, I would just use uh, this, right? Um, but now I think about it, now that I'm actually like streaming the game. I feel kind of self-conscious about it. Mm. You know what? Fine. I'll get used to people calling me NVIDIA, I guess. <laughs> Even though Telfox all the time just call me decaf. Burr. Decaf video? Did I spell that correctly? Oh wait, no, this is the first one of the- This is uh, the protagonist's voice. Decaf video. Did I spell that correctly? I guess alternatively I could just name them. Minato Arisato. <laughs> but uh, no, for the sake of just like... Uh, Letting it get my attention when I'm reading it, I'll keep it like this. Though there, I have no illusions to um, inserting myself into this game. Good. I'm just making choices with them. Time is something no one can escape. It delivers us all to the same end. You can't plug your ears or cover your eyes. And so, it begins. 
and so it begins. Okay, a little bit of different delivery there. Still pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The shadows were cool at the first time. They kind of ruined it by doing it already. Who's there? Pretty fast, bear. How are you here at this hour? Oh. Don't tell me. Wait. That. Oh, it's a side piece. Right, huh? right. That's what I'm forgetting. That's a gun. Remember, kids, you have to uh, make sure to meet curfew. Otherwise, the person who reaches at the door might not see you as human. The lights! I didn't think you'd arrive so late. My name is Mitsuru Kirijo. I'm one of the students who live in the storm. I'm looking at like the portrait and the, the character is like Mitsuru in the portrait. Uh, super curly hair with the, the bang and stuff. Mitsuru in the, uh, I guess, avatar art. From farther away, you don't see as many details. I wonder if the details will change if you get closer to people. Who's he? Ooh, there are cars coming outside. Cool. He's a transfer student. It was a last minute decision to assign him here. Oh, okay. It's just looping the same, like, three sets of cars. He'll eventually be moved to a room in the boy storm. Is it okay for him to be here? I guess we'll see. This is Yukari Takeba. Nice to meet you. She'll be a second year this spring, just like you. Ooh, right. Call me Takeba. Uh, just a heads up, folks. Um, I'm not going to be using the straight answers. Uh, well, I'll, I'll be making choices based on like my actual personality. So don't be surprised if I use the joke answers or like um, I'm not using the most optimized dialogue choices. <laughs> okay, so I already said nice to meet you, so I guess I'll use that. Why do you have a gun? This is the girl store? Nice to meet you. Uh, yeah. Yep. I'm not gonna ask about the gun. That seems like nice a smart to meet thing you to do. too. It's getting late. You'll find your room at the end of the hall on the second floor. Oh, and also heads up, folks. Um, I'm going to go for the romance route between uh, the PC protagonist and Yukari here. Actually, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. There are certain items you can get from from dating other characters in the game, uh, but I really like the the romance story between Yukari and the, the protagonist the best out of all of the options. Now, which one do I think is the worst? Well, when you meet that character, I'll I'll tell you all about it. Your things should already be there. Why don't you get some rest? Show you the way. Follow me. Hey, flickers. Alert. Okay. Oops. Oh, I see. So when I click away from from the game, it actually pauses and cutscenes and stuff. Well, that's kind of cool. Flickers is uh trying to organize a human trafficking ring. But the but the clap of my ass cheeks keeps alerting the authorities. <laughs> yeah, Flickers is um, both a player as well as the DM um, in those tabletop RPG games that they play over on that channel. So check them out. Here's your room. Pretty easy to remember, huh? 
since it's all the way at the end here. Um, do you have any questions? Yes. And I got a gun. Uh, what's the contract for? Does that kid live here too? Well, I think the contract is supposed to be signing us up for the Reaper program. Because um, it says, I deliver it all to the same end. And I agree to the above statement. So I guess we're just gonna become a serial killer. <laughs> who knows? Who knows? It's anime blood. Does that kid live here too? What kid? I don't know. What are you talking about? Come on, that's not funny. You are the know what I'm talking about. Uh, can I ask you something? On your way here from the station, was everything okay? Mm. Let's see. So, this, everything was green. There were coffins everywhere. Puddles of rusty red fluid on the floor. And all the power was out. Yeah, seems pretty normal to me. No, um, what do you mean? You don't know? I guess that means you're fine. Mm -hmm. Well, okay. Don't worry about it then. I won't. I'd better get going. See you around, Miss Takiba. Um... I'm sure you still have questions, but let's save them for later, okay? Good night! Okay, I should just leave auto on for voice acting parts. I'm way too slow in reacting. Ooh. Ah. The main protagonist's room. As nondescript as empty and empty as I remember. Life in the dorm starts today. The room can be furnished and everything. I'm spent. I should put my things in the closet and get to bed early. Saving your game. Oh, okay. Thank goodness we can actually save on the first day. <laughs> you have no many. You have no idea how many times that I've like played the game over and uh, forgot to save during the opening bits, and you know didn't get to save until later. Unless I'm misremembering, which you know, it's been about three years since my last playthrough. So, who knows? Who knows? You can save your progress in the game by pressing the options button. Saving is possible whenever options are displayed on the screen. When you save your game, it also saves a little bit of your past. You can go back to that time by opening the menu with triangle, going to system, and selecting rewind. Ooh, okay. So you can actually go back a few scenes. When you select the rewind slot, you will return to a point where you could roam freely shortly before you save your game. No, the rewind function does not save your new starting point automatically. If you use this function, make sure you continue to save your game if necessary. Got it, got it. You can check the tutorials that have been displayed here by opening the menu with triangle, going to system, and select the tutorial. Ooh, look at that. Cool little guy. 3,000 yen. Okay, everything's straight out. And we can save. <laughs> just a uh, just a little guy falling from the screen. No big deal. April sixth, Monday. Is there something on the shelf yet? Purchase DLC can be redeemed by checking the closet in your room. I should put my stuff away in the closet. Get out of the closet! Get out of the closet! Should I check the stuff inside the closet? You will now receive your downloadable content. Yes! Oh, cool. Oh. oh, hello! Hello, Raiders! Hello, hello! Welcome in, welcome in. Um, who raided me? It was... 
Wab. Thank you so much, Wab. Uh, let me go ahead and shout you out. I haven't yet today, so I can actually uh, do it with you here. Everyone check out uh, Web streams. Web is a variety streamer. He plays oh, video games, hangs out with friends, plays <laughs> d all the good stuff. That did oh. not work! Uh, also loves the fishing mini games. Um, oh. So, you know, if fishing games are your thing, uh, Web also does that kind okay. of thing. That Had to come work. by for a wonderful voice acting. Aw, thank you. Um, oh, fuck! Well, for this particular game, uh, I don't know how oh, much was right here side. for me before. You know the NPCs come out because the beginning sections are pretty much fully voice acted. You can ring my bell, ring my bell. 